Hello everyone, welcome back. One of my viewers asked a great question. They asked for a light recommendation for the Glock 26. Okay, so I got here the Polymer 80 uh, G26 and the light I have on there is the Streamlight TLR7 Sub, okay? Uh, this is a push button design. So basically you push forward, it's got a button on both sides. You push forward on the button to turn it on and off. Um, it's a pretty good design. I, I normally I carry this on my uh, Glock 43, Palm 80 Glock 43, but it also fits the uh, uh, the the Glock 26 uh, just perfectly. Okay, uh, it actually fits it a, a little bit better because with the Glock 43, the buttons come you know basically stick out a little bit more, uh, and sometimes when I go to put my finger uh, into the trigger guard, the, my my finger sometimes catches a little bit. Uh, on the buttons on the Glock 43, but on the Glock 26, I, there's just a little bit uh, more space. So the TLR7 sub uh, is a great matchup uh, to the Glock 26. Now on this one over here, uh, if you notice the barrel sticks out a little bit more, I do have the slightly longer barrel here. Basically that's a G19 barrel. The reason why I have a G19 barrel in here is because I find that I can shoot this more reliably with steel case ammunition. Um, with the, if, you know, if I'm carrying this with, uh, the standard G26 barrel, um, I use 124 grain bullets. Uh, I find the heavier bullet allows the pressure to, you know, basically the bullet is a little bit slower coming out of the barrel. So the pressure stays higher, a little bit longer. And the G26, um, I find, uh, cycles more reliably with the 124 grain bullets. Okay. Uh, but most days I just want to just shoot it and have some fun. So I'll just throw in there, I'll throw a G19 barrel into the G26, uh, and the gun works great. So uh, let's take a couple of shots. Now, this is a push-button design. So there's there's two buttons here on each side. You just push it forward to turn it on and off. Okay, so that's how that works, okay? So let's uh, let's move you guys over a little bit to an area where we can shoot. All right, so we'll do a little bit of shooting with the light now. Seeing all that is that I'm basically, you know, turning on the light, shooting, turning the light off, moving to a different position. Uh, after the light goes, you know, after I, sh um, I shoot the gun, right, I don't want to stay in that same position. I want to turn the light off, move to a different position, because wherever the light was last, that's where the bullets are all going to go, okay? Hope you guys enjoyed the video. So, again, this is the TLR7 Sub for the Glock 26. Thanks for watching. Uh, hit the bell button so you get notification of the new videos that I put up.